All right, we're at the finale of season two. I feel like I just started it and we're already almost done with it. It's called, If I May Shed Away, My Burden Now. Hmm. What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with the season two finale of Bungle Stray Dogs. With that being said, the full length version, which are normally a, a tier over on Patreon for the first and last episode of every season of every show we watch is available for free for everyone. So click the link at the top of the description. Enjoy that free full length. Come back here for the review when you're done. But if you guys enjoy that, consider checking out Patreon so you guys can keep that in the future. It's very good. It's very nice. Very nice. Other than that, I'm very excited to hop into this episode. We have the Were Tiger. We have Rashomon versus Mr. Moneybags himself all powered up all ready to go all insanity we have a duel of beliefs and a duel of physicality to save our city and this is all coming to a head and i am ready for it all i gotta watch this episode right now so i am hopping into it bungo stray dogs season 2 episode 12 the finale if i may shed away my burden now let's do this oh is this gonna be like oda's fight with jeed gonna play the opening while they fight this opening is a banger i won't lie oh my god look how powerful this man is all of his money is gone this man is i love how the green just gets more and more on him all over i wish i had the power to gain strength from the money i spent on anime clothes i could be doing the same thing <laughs> come on boys you got this He's saving Atsushi, <laughs> not even going on the offensive. They have a certain level of respect for each other. Come on, Atsushi. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Come on. Oh, Rashomon team up? Look at that fish. Oh my god. Literally ca causing the storm to dissipate. We can see, oh, this shot is insane. He runs out of money. He runs out of strength, right? <laughs> this is not what I would have ever expected for a finale like this. This is so insane. Oh my god. Now it's out Octagua for the Rashomon demonic armor tag team combo wear tiger. Oh. Oh, he's out of it too. Wait for me. Oh, uh, yep. Out of money, out of strength. Oh, he was, it's just a quick slide to cancel. Thank the Lord. Who is this? I didn't look like Mori Ugai or the room Mori would be chilling at. Who was that? That's your boy. Okay, Kyoka. No, that's what I was worried about. Hmm. I mean, yes, you're so right. <laughs> but in your last moments. I know she wouldn't. She is such a real one. Now it crashes into the water versus the city. I'm praying she somehow made it out of that, but if she didn't, man. Oh, 
So she did something, she did this and it made her pass, which control over the output of the abilities of another? Okay, I, I just thought he passively gained control over the seasons, but... So she became a member at the last second, yes. He, she, he was able to use her Demon Snow to cut her out of it. Demon Snow saved her. Let's go! <laughs> Let's go, Fukuzawa. Legend. Aww. That's so sweet. It's making me teary-eyed. Kept it from me. That's how. That's all I'm sad about. Oh, this is the whole thing they planned from the beginning. <laughs> what? This is crazy. <laughs> That's literally all he needed. And he's he's done for. Shouts out Kyoka, Atsushi, Octagawa, Fukuzawa. Damn, that's a great start to this finale. Is Herman joining the governmental agency for Gifted? Really? That's... I don't want to pause it for too long. That's just why he said... Before Moby Dick turned into this mechanical beast, it was beautiful, just like the guild used to be. I thought he meant before they got into the shady business of what they do now, but damn, okay, Herman. Shouts out, you, Mark. Sounds like Louisa. I, I think he is as well. Is that Lovecraft? How did he survive? This man is a legend! I don't know, he's gonna be a Cthulhu god. Trying to get some rest. Hey. Oh, like, to this day, wonder what's at the bottom of the ocean? Lovecraft is there. Lovecraft is down there. Everyone's gonna be there. Open arms, welcoming her in. I never, I mean, I knew I would like the ADA. I never thought I'd like them this much. Look at that. They're real ones. I know. Don't start crying. I'm going to start crying, Kyoka. Good times with good people. That's what you love to see. Oh, Poe? That is such a cute raccoon on Poe's shoulders. As a chess master, Mori knows how to use his pieces, and he knows his pieces' strengths. Because Kyoka. Has he had this plan from the jump? His is also such like Mori with that strip with that fucking smarts. He's so dope. Look at Carl. He, I know, he's super cute, that's what I keep saying. I wonder if Poe's gonna join or if he's just gonna be buddies with Rampo. That is a good question, where is Dazai? Oh, is that Hirotsu? No, okay, so he's the one who engaged for Octagua to be there as well. Makes sense. Makes sense. For the real disaster that's about to come. Ooh. 
This is the guy who hacked. Nathaniel? Pastor, if you order a crime and punishment. Fior, Fyodor D. Who is this? Season 3 is about to be a bop. Mm, interesting. R.I.P. Oda, man. Now the relationship very much reminds me of Deku and Bakugo from My Hero. Like a certain level of respect for each other. They still disagree on a lot of things and still argue all the time. But they make a hell of a team. That is a dope ass shot to end this season. I gotta give a round of applause for that season. See you, Bongo. I'll see you in a couple hours when I keep watching the show. God damn, that was good. I must say, for how everything ended up with Kyoka, with everything, and especially setting up a new threat in season three, just like they did with season two. This shit's hitting the fan. We have another mastermind behind the inner strife of the guild, you know, with Nathaniel and Fyodor D. I don't know how to say his name. So happy with what happened with Kyoka. That was crazy that they had that whole thing planned out from the jump. Ramp, well, of course, Rampo and Desai could figure this out. They're both just geniuses, but they had everything planned from getting Octagawa to team up with Atsushi, beat to, to beat Francis, and then for there to be no, for the outside party to hack into this which would make it inaccessible and then for Kyoka to force herself into uh you know dealing with it with the drone in order to self-sacrifice to save people which ended up being her test to joining the ADA and she passed it with flying colors and we finally learned Fukuzawa's ability which is all men are created equal he's able to generate the output of anyone who's a part of the ADA's abilities and so he was able to help her control uh, Demon Snow, which she doesn't even need the phone anymore. Same, like, I just thought that Atsushi, after using the Were Tiger a few times, has just been able to do it naturally, but no, I mean, Fukuzawa's a legend. He's actually insane. And all that, the fact that all that was according to plan was so just brilliant. And it, I don't, it wasn't according to Mori's plan, but Mori knew exactly what was going on and, and knows this is in best interest. And it's like, they're both just such good tacticians. It's crazy to me. Actually crazy. You know these last few episodes have been just getting me like so enthralled in the episodes. I did not write anything down for 9, 10, 11, or 12. Just so good. So good. The fight at the beginning, so good. I did feel bad for Francis because of, you know, his overall goal. But we have John who's going to try to stop the inner strife. Like a lot of our characters are going to be returning, which I like. Mark seems to be leaving. Luisa is going to be looking for Francis. He might come back. John's going to be doing this thing. Lovecraft is probably out of here. He's going to be sleeping. We got Poe who might join the ADA. I sure hope so. That'd be dope. Um, it never it never hurts having another smart detective, you know, especially one that at least Rampo respects a little bit. It's it's just crazy. I thoroughly enjoyed the ending. I was getting teary eyed with Kyoka because she deserves it. It's so amazing. Season three is about to be insane. I could tell. If you guys enjoyed, please leave a like. Let me know your thoughts down below. Don't forget to subscribe. Click that bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Follow all the social medias. Instagram, Twitch, TikTok, Twitter. All the Dapper Darius. Much, much appreciated, y'all. Have a great day. Drink some water. Be safe. Tell someone you love them. Peace.